good morning uh, so in our next practical we are going to evaluate cns depression activity so experiment is study of cns depression activity using octophotometer yes, so this is the instrument uh, as we have previously seen that this instrument it is known as the octophotometer and in the octophotometer this is a central chamber central chamber and light sources clear here it is the light sources are there and the photo cells are present which is opposite side so each light sources is focused on the photo cells what will happen any interruption in the path of light activates the photo cell and this counted as measures of horizontal locomotor activity so what does it mean whenever we are going to keep the animal animal it will move to one to another direction as a result it will cause the interpret or it will uh, results the interpret the path of light that is inter uh, interpretation of path of light that means the light it will not fall onto the photo cell and as a result it will count it so this is number of the locomotor activity so if the movement is more the count is more if the movement is less count is less so that is the basic principle now what we are going to do whenever we are going to give generally we can give the cns stimulant drug or the cns suppression drug to the animal so what will be happen for example if you are giving the cns stimulant drug it will cause the stimulation of the cns now whenever it will cause the stimulation of the cns the movement it will be more clear movement in the more movement more means count it will be more so uh, compared to the control similarly if there is a cns depression drug what will happen cns depression drug then the movement it will be less so count it will be less compared to the control group now this particular instrument is very helpful to evaluate the central nervous system uh, the drugs acting on the central nervous system that means cns stimulated or cns depression drug and uh, here you can find the grid line also so here we can put the um, electric shock also to many but if we are putting the electric shock what you have to remember that for control as well as the drug treated group same type of electric shock we should give otherwise uh, this is also uh, alter our experimental results so this is the instrument through which we are evaluating the CNS depression activity. So this is the octophotometer. So in next we are going to see about that how we are performing the practical using this instrument. So uh, hope you have understood. There is uh, what is the principle involved in this particular.